And welcome on a rainy night. The heavens opened earlier and it just hasn't relented. I'm Derek Ray and ready with his tactics board alongside me is Stuart Robson, my commentary partner. And what we have to look forward to is the second leg of this Champions League semi-final. It's Real Sociedad facing Real Madrid. Well, the first leg was a really good game, Derek. It had action at both ends, it was an even contest and it's set up perfectly for this second leg. Hopefully we're not disappointed. So the starting 11 for Real Sociedad. Oyarzabal plays with Adnan Yanuzay in the wide areas. And in this tactical setup, they have just the one player in attack. Course making quite a bit of progress. Mendy. Committed challenge. And the starting players for Real Madrid. Thibaut Courtois is the keeper of choice. Carvajal starts with Ferlon Mendy in the fullback positions. Luka Modric plays with Casemiro in the centre of the pitch. And beginning the game up front today, Karim Benzema. Moving the ball effectively, looking for the right moment. And a bad pass it was. Promising sequence. Mendy. Regain possession. Karim Benzema, who's played at such a high level in an attacking sense for so long. Stuart, what do you anticipate seeing from him here? Well, he's been great since joining the club. He's their leading goal scorer, and it's his movement that's been so good. If the defenders get too tight, he'll spin in behind them. If they drop off, he'll turn and run at them. Let's hope we see the best of him today. Look at Modric. Well, they've lost the ball. Delightful pass. Rico. Well, the timing of the pass, that little bit off. Mendy. Benzema. High quality defending. And options in the centre. And they took a touch on the way through. So a corner here. Who can they pick out? Superb block. They'll repeat the trick. Corner again. And over comes the corner. Well, nothing comes of the attack when all is said and done. Alaba. Now with Benzema. Well, it looked highly promising, but they got nothing out of it. David Silva. Onto Rafinha. Alexander Surlot. The cross is on. Well, thumped clear. Vinicius Junior. A real opening now. And a goal! It's Modric to put his team in front. Well, let's see this again. This is counter-attacking football at its very best. But how is he allowed that much time and space? He doesn't even have to jump to head it in. It's a good finish, but terrible defending. Away again here, 
1 0 to score. Alexander Surlot. And in possession, Yanazai. Definitely look as though they want to make this move count. And the ball with Surlot. And a strong tackle. Could be a chance to break here. Well, it fizzled out. Not a huge chunk of added time. One minute. Casemiro. Benzema. Vinicius Jr. Excellent block. A chance then for the respective managers to address their charges. It is half time here. Superb block. They'll repeat the trick. Corner again. A real opening now. And a goal! It's Modric to put his team in front. And they're underway in the second half of this Champions League semi-final second leg. Oyar Sabal. On to Rico. Bad challenge. And now it's up to the referee in terms of what to do next. Well, the card is out. And it's yellow. Yeah, it's clumsy and it's light. Definitely a yellow card. To the box it goes. Really a very poor ball. He's got the right idea with that pass. Oh, could be a chance. Well, the keeper was called upon and delivered. Well, he's so good in those 1v1 moments and he's proved it yet again. It's a short one, he cuts it back, Asensio just wanted to get it out of there. Andrej, and a fantastic diving save. Corner kick played in. Well, still an issue here. Look at Modric. Oh, a good diving save. Well, Real Madrid are going to make the change now. Trying to pick out a teammate. Not all that convincing defensively. Alaba. Benzema. There it is. A fantastic goal. And no wonder he's off celebrating. Well, just look at his strength here. He holds off the challenge, he keeps his balance, and he finds the back of the net. It's a wonderful goal.
to check on the aggregate score. It is 2-0. 30 minutes to go then. Porto. Now with Rafinha. Isaac. Goro Sabel. Real defensive commitment there. Mendy. Mendy has it. Karim Benzema. Well, they keep the ball moving. Oh, the threat is there. The referee has given the advantage to Real Madrid. Casemiro. And diving to thwart him. Good officiating, waiting for the play to stop and now going back to caution him. Over it comes. Well, the clearance half-hearted. Gives it a go. Able to get a body in the way. And it will be a free kick to Real Madrid. the goal disallowed you can see why offside Stuart yeah and I think he knew as well immediately looked over his shoulder to check for the linesman Aritz Lenormand on to Rafinha very good reading of the game to win possession back Carvajal I think you've got to conclude that was good refereeing a free kick in the end after initially playing advantage but it just wasn't there And he's clear as lines. This might be ideal for the counter. Can they take advantage? Now a decent position. And he did what he had to do defensively. Happy to take on the shot. Well, closed down straight away. Real chance. Well, here's the replay. Watch how he goes past his man with such ease, and it's just a change of pace. And then just look at the finish, Derek. He reads the flight perfectly and absolutely smashes it beyond the goalkeeper. There's just no stopping that. is the aggregate lead David Alaba the electric
electronic board has been held in the air and we're going to have a minimum of four added minutes that's a well struck pass Carvajal how about the cross well, they couldn't take advantage of the opportunity Casemiro and there it is, the whistle, it's the end of the contest and Real Madrid will ascend to the high altar of the Champions League final. Well, that was a brilliant tie. Two teams throwing everything at it, both physically and mentally. But I think the better team over the two legs has gone through to the final. And what a game that will be. And the shining light for his side, Karim Benzema. Well, he should be pleased with himself today because he performed really well, he scored a good goal and they won the game. An excellent day all round.